time for some old school dirt racing here at uh, Augusta, something like that. Yeah, this is our second time coming to this track. Of course, first time for this series, obviously. It's a no-brainer right there. So, we had convertibles run here. Now we have trucks running here. We might have uh, the Fluttershy Truck Series run here one day. Oh yeah. Hold on a minute. Gotta turn out that smoke. Oh yeah, it's right here. Alright. John Mongold, Chris Washer. Green flags out. Old fashioned dirt race track with banking. Perfect. Ain't it? Clean racing for now. John Mongo gets off to a good lead. Here comes a 20 to the inside. You gotta take it real slow. 120, I think, is the fastest. He's that high side. One truck is on the apron. No trouble, one truck's upside down actually, the 94 truck, again! Caution it, oh my god! Now everyone now starts to wreck. We're still going, the 18's now upside down, Martinsville winner! Holy hell, what the hell just happened? Well, that's one, that's the only, uh... uh bad thing about putting these, uh, trucks on the dirt, cause that that guardrail right there it's gonna it's gonna flip your truck no matter what let's take a look what happened take a look Dylan T and the 54 Andrew Hills make contact and both of them get launched and whoa look at that 94 goes upside down and the 54 oh my god he took a harder hit look at this look at look how high that truck went up Look how close the grandstands are. The thing just whoa, man! The thing is like bouncing around, around the front stretch too. Whoa, man! That's hard to, to watch. Truck just slamming on its uh, roof like that. Watch this! Oh, look at this! The 17 dumps DJ Curtis. Everyone gets involved in this one, and look at how many trucks get launched. The 83, the two, the 38. There's a 29. Then the 18 was about to escape, and then he gets hit by the one truck of the Brit Mongold. Patrick Mule goes all upside down, right on, right on the banking. That was that's a crazy wreck right there, man. That was pretty wild. Red flag is out. We'll take you back to the restart. Coming to the green here. 26 trucks left. And, uh, there are two trucks now going to start on the inside. 17 for some reason. We're up to the outside lane for a second there. Pace truck is in. Here we go. Green flag. The 8 truck has led every single lap we've raced so far. Nicholas, Guerra, and the 20 truck catching up. 17 going right by the 6. He's trying to get a lap back. There's the 14 of Sean Marple. Trying to get past the 6. Here comes the 20 now. Man. No trouble! One truck's up in the air, that's a six, and he's stuck. Trying to get a right camera right here. Okay, there we go. Caution is out again. The eight is still leading this race. Well, let's take a look. Can't really see it from here, but the 12 looks like he got into the 20. 
squeezes the 620 goes up into the air, but the 6 truck, however, goes upside down and, and he's stuck. This truck is stuck in the guardrail. 12 of uh, Ken T as well. Does not uh, get it rolling. Looks like his day is already done. So, second caution of the day. We'll now take you back. Here we go. The six is actually still in this thing. Wow. Amazing, isn't it? Pace truck is in. Here we go. And there's a green flag. Man, John Mongo has been leading everything. Didn't even allow the one to lead once. Six is gonna cause another wreck, maybe. No, actually, no, that wasn't really his fault that time. But he better get out of the way of the 14 way, because he's wanting to dump him, and there he goes, he's in the wall. He dumped him, and oh, the three I think just got caught up, and oh, there goes everyone else. Wow. These cameras on the back stretch are kind of annoying. Caution is out again. I don't know what I'm gonna do. Wait, it looks like the three truck actually escaped. Let's take a look at what happened. Helicopter cam, you see Sean Harple in, in the 14? Yep. I knew that was gonna happen. He dumps the 60, hits hard in the guardrail, and wow, look at that three! And just got into LaPlante, who ends up hitting the uh, pit road wall head on. So he's out of this one. You could escape, but yeah. But then he ends up hitting the 32 anyways. Watch this. Wow. Then, uh, damn it. Watch the plan here. We fast forward. I don't know what the hell he was doing. But, bam. Even the 5 made some contact. Why the hell are there RVs on pit road? Gotta be real careful. Two Hendrick trucks wrecked on pit road. Well, for the 25, not exactly, but you know what I mean. Let's take you back. Get ready for the restart. 22 trucks uh, is remaining on the track. So there's the green flag again. Chris Kyle, of course, not in second. Chris Washer is, however. file. John Long goes to let every single lap. He's going up to the high side. That gives Washer the advantage, maybe. Nope, 17. Could have pushed the 8 up top. But here comes Washer on the low side. Oh, trouble back there, I think. That was making a lot of contact. Washer clears the 17. 17 trying to cross over him, and oh, here comes the 20 now. 6 to go. He do not want Chris Collin right in the mix of this, they want to figure this thing out. Washer is now being held back because of the 17. The 8 of John Von Gold led every single lap. The 17. I think he's helping now. Now he's helping the drivers. I don't want that 8 truck to dominate everything. I don't mind if he wins this race. Just don't dominate the whole thing. It's boring. Four laps to go left here at this weird ass dirt track. Not exactly. I haven't really seen a really banged dirt racetrack. Well, even the 17 out of the way, the 20 and the 43 have not caught up yet. The 8 truck is way too strong right from the start. Battle for another spot. I think that's, yeah, that's the 4 3. The 8 took the low side that time. If we have trouble on the racetrack, caution is out. Yes, it is. Caution is out. Race is over. And the 23 gets dumped for no reason by the 74. Oh, well, looks like John Mongol is going to win this race. We'll take a look at what happened, though. 
This is going to be pretty wild. Or look at Jay Stella getting dumped by the 7 truck right there. Just dumps him. Gets him to the guardrail. Upside down. Barrel rolling. 21 checks up. Oh, man. Then the 52 hard. Thing still goes for a roll. And right on top of the 21 again. Take a look at the chase cam. Far chase cam. That's uh, much better to look at, I think. Okay, no, maybe not. Chase. Gets dumped by the 7. Just hit the guardrail. That fence is too short. Look at that thing. Oh, man. And another one right in the windshield. Still, still flipping, still flipping right on top of the 21. Brings out our final caution of the day. Race ends under caution. And now we'll just show you the full race results. So the official results. John Mongold scores the win here at... Augusta, I think so. Yeah. Nicholas Garrett came close. He was right there with the A at one point. So did Washer. Riley Houston, after rec uh, avoiding that wreck, he finishes fourth. Sean Harpel fifth. Sixth, New Zealand seventh. Jacob Robinson eight. Kevin Mendon ninth. Trista Parker in tenth. Dan Bandon your top ten. Twenty trucks finished the race. Here's the rest of the race results. And now to take you to victory lane.